JX Nippon Mining and Metals is an integrated producer of copper and related metals. JX owns and operates copper mines in South America and refines copper ore in Japan to produce copper metal. This copper and related metals provide raw materials for our electronic materials. JX then supplies these electronic materials to our customers. JX also runs a recycling business to support environmentally friendly and sustainable societies. JX has built strong upstream, midstream, and downstream supply chains. Let's look at some key business figures. JX has a global market share of 80% for rolled copper foil for flexible printed circuits, 60% for sputtering targets for semiconductors, 50% for indium phosphide wafers, and 30% for high purity tantalum powder. JX produces 450,000 tons of copper per year and recovers 6 tons of rare metals per year from recycling. JX owns copper mining rights for 200,000 tons per year. Now, let's look at JX Electronic Materials lineup. Nowadays, reliability of electronic components is far more important than ever. To ensure reliability, each device needs to be connected firmly even under harsh conditions. JX's original titanium copper alloy, NKT322, offers outstanding reliability as a connector material. Copper titanium is the strongest copper alloy. Moreover, it is beryllium-free, easy to recycle. Also, NKT322 has good formability. Not only high strength, NKT322 has excellent heat resistance. Let's look at the high heat resistance of titanium copper. Here are two springs made of titanium copper and beryllium copper. If we apply a certain load and make them shrink, and then heat them up and allow some time, once the load is removed, the springs lose their springiness. This parameter is referred to as stress remaining. This graph shows the stress remaining after heating to 150 degrees Celsius. Titanium copper shows excellent heat resistance properties compared to other copper alloys. Five G and big data require high speed data transmission. This is accompanied by more current in devices and connecting parts. What happens if these components use conventional copper alloys? Take the example of phosphor bronze, which has 12% IACS electrical conductivity and is widely used as a contact material. If you apply a large current such as 5 amps, which may require a recent connection to the phosphor bronze contact, the temperature immediately rises to more than 100 degrees Celsius. However, if you replace phosphor bronze with our NKC4820, which has 60% IACS electrical conductivity, the temperature rise can be curbed to less than 20 degrees Celsius. JX Original Corson Alloy is a promising material for high current usages in high speed data transmission. Flexible printed circuits called FPCs are used to connect internal components and in electronic devices such as smartphones and millimeter wave radar supporting autonomous vehicles. Our rolled copper foils are widely used in FPCs and millimeter wave radars. The reason for this is that HAV2JX original rolled copper foil offers outstanding flexibility for FPCs. Another important technology for FPCs is microsurface treatment. FPCs have a structure that stacks copper foil in polyethylene terephthalate or PET. To achieve firm adhesion to PET, copper foil needs to have the surface roughened but a rougher surface causes transmission loss. 
JX has developed a microsurface treatment with lower transmission loss. Low-profile BHM treatment and double-flat HAV2 foil are used in applications with high-frequency transmission. With the increasing electrification of automobiles and industrial robots, it is becoming more important to control noise from electromagnetic interference, or EMI. One way to manage EMI noise is to use shielded cables. JX supplies tin copper PET as a shielding material for shielded cables. Conventional shielding materials made of copper braids are heavy. Aluminum PET is a popular option for weight reduction, weighing just one-tenth as much as copper braids. However, aluminum is prone to corrosion. JX tin copper PET weighs almost the same as aluminum PET. But thanks to its surface tin layer, it has excellent corrosion resistance. With the arrival of the 5G era, there is growing need to shield high-frequency noise, requiring highly reliable materials with good shielding performance. JX Tin Copper PET offers the perfect shield solution for various cables. Electronic devices must be resistant to failures and malfunctions caused by various noises. Development of high-performance shielding material is necessary to shield electronic components and noise sources. Whatever your usage, our formable sheet product can be molded into various shapes to cover the entire noise source without gaps. This enables our shielding material to be used for various electronic components in applications such as electric vehicles, telemedicine, drones, and industrial robots. This graph shows magnetic shielding effectiveness measured by the KEC method. Our product has higher shielding effectiveness than conventional shielding materials at 500 kHz or more. Because it is composed of copper foil and resin film, this new shielding material is only half the weight of conventional metal products, making it useful for weight reduction. Furthermore, it can be formed into arbitrary shapes by the drawing method. The combination of high-performance rolled annealed copper foil with an adhesive and film suitable for drawing achieves high levels of moldability. Five G enables high-speed smartphone communication, but this requires more power and batteries with high energy density. This is a schematic image of a lithium-ion smartphone battery. The active material containing lithium-ion is divided by a separator, and the electric charge is collected by current collectors on both sides. Copper foil is widely used as a cathode current collector. In high-energy density lithium-ion batteries, silicone-based material is used as an active material. This material shows a large degree of deformation in charging and discharging. High-strength copper foil is required to ensure reliable battery performance. This chart shows the relationship between foil strength and heat treatment temperature. The most commonly used copper foil for lithium-ion batteries is electrodeposited foil. Tough-pitch copper foil is widely known as a high-strength copper foil, and its strength drops less than electrodeposited foil when heat treated. JX HS1200 V2 Original Copper Foil has greater strength than such conventional copper foils, even at higher temperatures. Lithium-ion battery processing sometimes requires higher temperature treatment. In such cases, we also have a solution in the form of our newly developed foil for lithium-ion batteries. JX high-strength copper foil is supporting a new generation of lithium-ion battery development. JX Nippon Mining and Metals will keep developing leading-edge materials to enhance the evolution of electronics and information technologies for future generations.